comedian David Boyle and I'm quitting alcohol. So it turns out a lot of you cunts out there have ADHD, eh? Surprise, surprise, there's a fucking correlation between alcoholism and fucking mental illness. I found out today that ADHD falls under the umbrella of neurodivergent, whatever the fuck that means. I'm neurodivergent. I think it's autistics, ADHD, trans, retarded, (laughs) Asian. There's a lot of fucking things that fall under fucking neurodivergent. Honestly, that sounds like something a white lady made up to feel better about herself. I also found out (laughs) if you have like two neurodivergencies, if that's the word, if you have like autism and ADHD... You're called double exceptional. You're double exceptional. Like, I get that you shouldn't be calling people retards. I still do, but I get why you shouldn't. Like, it's not very nice. You're fucking retarded. But the fucking pendulum swing to double exceptional, from fucking retarded to double exceptional, that is quite the fucking swing. And that would be pretty confusing for fucking retards. I don't know if the double exceptional would be able to process that shit. Since I did the ADHD thing yesterday, I've had people reaching out saying you're one of us. You've always been one of us. And so I'm going to fucking go get a diagnosis. I don't know if my ADHD is going to allow me to fucking do it though. There's so many fucking hurdles between me and my neurodivergent fucking diagnosis. I got to go to a doctor for starters, which I fucking hate hate seeing those dumb cunts. I've got to get a fucking referral from those fuckwits to a fucking psychologist, a failed fucking doctor, and then I got to go in there and pretend I have ADHD. I'll I'll, <laughs> I'll have I'll go in there and I'll think I'm pretending I have ADHD and they'll be like, "No, you've 110 got it, cunt." I'll walk in, I'll be like, sorry, I'm 45 minutes late, I lost my phone. I couldn't remember where I put it, then I went to fucking Subway and almost beat the shit out of some cunt in front of me in the line. You're like, so what are you here for today? I'm like, oh, I want to know if, I, I don't know, maybe I have ADHD or something, I don't know. So what makes you think that? Um, Because I feel like grabbing you by the fucking tie and smashing your head into the fucking desk, you know? <laughs> And because I didn't do my fucking homework at school. So there's a lot of fucking hurdles. Doctor, then psychologist. I've got to somehow fucking convince a psychologist that I've got all this shit. But I want a fucking certificate or something once I get it. I want something that says I'm fucking special. I feel like, though, if I was in the Amazon, if I was one of the lost fucking tribes, and I'd had no contact with fucking modernity... And I'm just fucking out there with a spear and my fucking balls hanging out and a little bit of fucking paint. And I'm really hungry. And the only way to get food is to like hide in a tree and sit still for fucking 10 hours until like a fucking possum or a toucan or something crawls past me. And then I fucking stab it and that's my food. I feel like I would be able to do that. I feel like if I had one thing to focus on, it would be okay. I wouldn't have undiagnosed ADHD. I feel like it might be because there's 4 billion different things to fucking think about at the moment. Even subconsciously, you walk past a fucking advertisement or something like that, that goes into your subconscious, mixes up, it fucks with your consciousness. That's just like something you're walking past. That's not even something you're consciously thinking about. And then you've got fucking kids family, fucking Netflix, emails, Instagram, how am I going to get more followers, podcast fucking listeners, how am I going to get more cunts to fucking sign up to the Patreon, how am I going to get more cunts not to fucking quit the Patreon, how am I going to find a doctor to give me this diagnosis, there's a lot going on, there's a lot fucking mixing around, there's a lot of soup fucking getting mixed around there, whereas if I was in the Lost Tribe, I have no phone, Your balls are out. You don't even know your fucking balls are out. No one cares. Everyone's balls are out and tits are out. So you're just walking around. You're not even, that's not even something in your head. You're just thinking, I'm fucking hungry. I want to eat a toucan or a macau or something. And then I want to fucking do some ayahuasca. 
and maybe bang one of the tribes woman. That's it. Three thoughts and maybe I'll have a nap. Four thoughts. I think that might be the problem. Anyway, I'm fucking on a quest to get my diagnosis. This could take up to like fucking three to five years, but I'll try and fucking expedite the whole thing, get it happening quicker, but I'm going to fucking have to overcome my undiagnosed AD. HD. <laughs> anyway, that will fucking do for today. If you're enjoying the podcast, just go directly to my Patreon. Give me some fucking money. That would be nice. And yeah, I'll see you the fuck later.